Right, so I just adore Green Day's December 1997 hit Good Riddance, Time of Your Life. Sonically, it was a tonal shift for the band from their regular pop-punk style. It incorporates a delicate acoustic guitar. It's all overlaid with some beautiful strings and harmonics. But you know me, it's the lyrics I love to look at. Now at a high level, Billy Joe Armstrong says he wrote the song for an ex-girlfriend who had moved away. But I really want to get inside his head a bit more here. I love how the song is called Good Riddance. The title itself is trying to mask the utter pain of losing a loved one who wants to move on. You know, the rejection of it all. The agony is masked behind a veil of anger. Good Riddance is him saying, fine, go then, beat it, you're not worth it. But we can see through the facade. This is a man mourning the relationship and suffering a broken heart. Those opening lyrics are just haunting. Another turning point, a fork stuck in the road. Time grabs you by the wrist, directs you where to go. This is saying you think you have a path in life. A path with this person you love. But it can be shattered in an instant. It's something unpredictable. There's a sense of him feeling sorry for himself here. But also an acceptance of the situation. But in the end, it's right. The second verse is the epitome of what true love is all about. It's a declaration that it's better to have loved and lost than to have never loved at all. The memories with this person are etched into his brain and despite his heartbreak, he'd do it all over again. For what it's worth, it's worth all the while. There's a sense that he longs for her to remember him, remember what they once had and in some way maybe this will bring her back. I hope you had the time of your life. This is a request to her to think back on what they once had together and maybe it's a form of reverse psychology. You know, I don't care if you go, so maybe she'll stay. But ultimately, he knows, she knows and we know that it's all futile.